Go behind the scenes with CMT's new comedy, Still the King. My character, Burnham Vernon, is a guy that in the late 80s had a humongous hit record. In the midst of his fame, he imploded. He's now on the downswing of everything. He's an Elvis impersonator. It's the only gig he can get. No one wants to hire him to be who he was, which is a one-hit wonder. I know you. You're Burnham Vernon. Yeah, that's me, the guy from the 90s, sang that one song. I thought you were dead. He finds out that he's got a 15-year-old daughter that he's never seen. You look like hell. Oh, hey there. They didn't tell me I had two illegitimate daughters. Cut the crap, Vernon. Can I just see her? I mean, see if she looks like mine. Oh, she's yours. And you can see her just as soon as you pay your child support. It's court order. You can tell when you read scripts if the writers love their characters. And I really feel like the writers on this really love their characters. He don't look rich. I told you, it's royalty money. Ah, oh, he's British. I mean, it's very comical, but at the same time, it has a Serious undertone, especially the connection between Vernon and his daughter, Charlotte. Lying is wrong. You should never lie, unless it's to save someone else's feelings, or it helps you get what you want, or it just makes things easier for you in one way or another. Otherwise, it's wrong. Okay, great life lesson. We've been blessed with not only our regular cast, but the guests who've came in and out of being part of the show. Action. You wanna speed it up, bub? That Eric Estrada behind me. It starts out where I'm behind him and, 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 I, and I punch him out and I beat him up. Hey! You get on your feet, Vernon Brown. You can run from a chip, but you can't hide from a chip. Vernon comes to the church and realizes he can bamboozle the uh, congregation to believe that he's a minister in order to take money from the parishioners and pay his child support. How's the Lord's work, Pastor? Some ladies have fallen from the Lord, and I'm going to do my darndest to bring them back. I mean, that much goodwill, that could take all night. I hope so. I think that the character of Vernon is so likable and endearing, and um, even with his kind of like wild side to him, he's someone that you really root for, which I think is really important for a series. <laughs> I've never made it with the preacher before. Well, honey, then we got something to come. Woo! <laughs> There's always that constant push and pull between light and darkness. Shoot me your number and remind me your first and last name. We'll do it again sometime. Pastor Johnson. Coming! Sin and redemption. You know, it's finding that fine line and going through this thing that we all call life. Still the King. Coming this June on CMT. Are you looking at my boobs? Was I? <laughs>